of world's highest railway bridge, Chenab Railway Bridge, engineers faced various challenges and the biggest challenge was its height. Even before starting the construction of Chenab Railway Bridge, the engineers decided to construct the gantry crane first. The crane which is right there on your television screen in the colors of white, green and red was constructed first at the Jammu side and after that various multiple strong wires were used to connect the both ends of Jammu and Kashmir and you can on my right hand side see as to how uh, the crane was constructed on the, on the Kashmir side. So you can see the wires, those were used to transport um, the equipments because it was not easy uh, to carry equipments uh, manually as uh, it was on such a huge height. So on both ends, uh, you can still see the cranes, uh, those um, whose height is uh, uh, more than uh, Qutub Minar. These cranes were constructed first and after that, um, the construction of uh, bridge started. After the uh, bridge was completed from both the ends, uh, the uh, central point was connected. You can see uh, this is the golden joint uh, which connects uh, uh, the bridge uh, from both the ends. Uh, and uh, this uh, yellow line which you are right now seeing is uh, now called the golden uh, joint and uh, uh, multiple uh, uh, bolts and uh, nuts have been used uh, to connect the bridge and this is the central point of this entire Chenab Railway Bridge. After the 10 years of hard work, Chenab Railway Bridge is now ready to be dedicated to the nation. Right now, we are present uh, at Chenab Railway Bridge, which is all set to be inaugurated on April 19 by PM Narendra Modi. Right behind me, you can also see the engineering marvel railway track, uh, which has been designed to give uh, all weather connectivity you can see the space uh, which has been given right uh, under the railway track and also right adjacent to the track uh, uh, for the snow remember that if there is a heavy snowfall during that time also there can be easy uh, rail movement uh, train movement for that uh, different technologies have been used here by the engineers uh, and if you talk about the height of this railway bridge uh, it is at least uh, 1,315 meters above Chenab Railway Bridge. You can see as to how the Chenab River is flowing beneath this bridge and right above that uh, we are now seeing as to how uh, the, uh, the bridge has been constructed using different technology. As we are filing this report, a locomotive is also uh, passing through this uh, railway track uh, uh, with uh, a high speed. Remember that this track has been uh, uh, you know, constructed to give uh, a, a good connectivity to Kashmir and on that railway, on this railway track, uh, a uh, train can run with the speed of uh, 200 km per hour. At the same time, this entire area comes uh, uh, in seismic zone 5, which means that um, uh, the officials, railway officials, um, have collected the data of last 100 years of uh, at least 150 km area surrounding this uh, entire uh, area so that, uh, you know, proper technology uh, can be used for constructing this entire bridge. Now, to also give proper security to this entire area, various CCTVs have been installed on this entire track. You can see CCTV cameras, high definition CCTV cameras have been installed here to keep a tight vigil on each and every movement. This entire track is of 272 kilometers in which 19 kilometer is under tunnel and 13 kilometer is on bridge where the railway will move with high speed. So now this bridge, engineering marvel, is ready to be dedicated to the nation on, and on April 19, PM Narendra Modi is going to address the people of Jammu and Kashmir and dedicated this bridge to the entire nation. With video journalist Ankit Singh, I am Piyush Mishra in Jammu for India Today. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.